in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit, one God in me. Sometimes we think, how can we possibly pray all the time? What would we say? We think this because everything we could ask for can be requested in like 10 minutes maximum. What will we talk about next? What about people in paradise who naturally pray without ceasing? We strive to pray without ceasing, which is a commandment to keep our thoughts from wandering away from God to the greatest extent possible. But in paradise, this is not a commandment. It just happens naturally without any effort. They are in a continuous state of praying because they can't stop looking at Christ and the angels and the saints. The whole atmosphere is joy and beauty and prayer. How do they pray all the time? They pray all the time through the lens of thanksgiving. The life of thanksgiving is a prelude to life in heaven. The one who feels thankful, and this feeling increases every day, is on the path to entering heaven. The life of thanksgiving is an expression of how much we rejoice in the Lord and trust Him. That's why we find many verses encouraging us to give thanks to God. Let's confess that we truly don't thank God enough. We take lots of things for granted. We consider waking up in the morning as something normal. No, it's not normal. It's possible you wouldn't have woken up this morning. We take the sun rising as normal. No, it's not normal. It's possible it wouldn't have risen. We consider living in a safe country as normal. No, it's not normal. It could be destroyed. We consider finding our beloved ones in safety and good health as normal. No, it's not normal. This is a gift from God. The things we take for granted are all continuous, unceasing gifts from God. We just consider them natural rights. It is like a poor man who, in the beginning, asked for money with all humility and poverty of spirit, and you oblige, giving him fifty or a hundred pounds. Then, after six months, he says to you, Where's my money? Your money? He thinks it's his right. This is what we do with God. Everything in our life is a gift from God. But after some time, we consider it to be our right. So instead of thanking God, we begin to argue with him if something goes missing from these gifts. It is not your right, it is a gift. Did you do something to make the sun rise or even make yourself breathe? This is all from God. There's a verse in Daniel saying, Those who are wise will shine like the brightness of the heavens. It means that people who are wise and understand this correctly will shine forever. Those wise people are few. The one who understands this thanks God all day long, because what shall I return to the Lord for all his goodness to me? He floods me with his kindness morning and night without me asking. The most precious thing, which I never thought about, he provides it before I ask. So he deserves thanksgiving and gratitude all the time.